Hey, what up, guys? It's uh, about 7 a.m. in the morning. We're on our way from Washington, D.C., heading to Seattle, then from Seattle to Beijing. 17 hour flight. This entire flight says it was a 17 hour flight, so definitely gonna be the experience. Literally just lost a day and a half. We made it! We made it! Hey! hey. Gardi! Hi! Chris! Snapchat! <laughs> So as you can see, uh, pollution's pretty bad out. Gotta wear your safety mask. We have to come here to get registered. It's one of their laws. We have to register. We have 24 hours. The pollution's so bad today, you can barely see the sun. Yeah. Look how cool that is. kids going to school <laughs> we're going to Gardi school today to meet the kids Bikes and scooters. Okay, I know, right? The yeah, pollution's the clearing! Pollution. <laughs> <laughs> Temple of Heaven. Burning stoves. Look how bad that is. Oh my god. Oh my god. Life in China. Well, we, we respect no car laws. Subway. Got vending machines on the metro. This is their metro. 
to Glassdoor. Metro, Metro. Nice and clean. Coming? Oh, hell no. Look how busy that is. Let me grab one. Let me grab one. Excuse me, excuse me. <laughs> oh my god this car, car oh my god what the hell this car don't care about the pedestrian here oh my goodness oh heading to the great wall great wall today King great wall great wall great wall, great wall. Birthday. Happy Little birthday speaker. back there. Happy <laughs> birthday, dude. <laughs> great wall, great wall, great wall. Let's go, great wall. Made it to the great wall. This is beautiful. Jump in. You know, it's like a pancake, basically. What what did she put in this? Some crunch on it? Egg? I don't know. Let's see. Tastes like fried rice. It's good. Gotta walk up this long hill. We have to walk up all these, th and we have to walk up all these stairs now. All right, we're making some progress. Still got a long way to go. Seems like the stairs get narrower and narrow. Just gotta take it one step at a time. Look down. By the time I look up, I'll be there. All right, so we're definitely making progress with this hill. And we can actually see part of the wall right there. It just goes to show you each step takes you forward to your dreams. Your dreams come true as long as you believe. All right, all right. We're right next to the wall. Our crew is right there. Just a couple more steps and we've made it to the top. The Gray Wall of China. We could have taken this little cart, but we actually climbed the whole wall by ourselves and now we're gonna slide down because we already walked it up this is crazy it keeps going all that is the gray wall there's a tower up there we already climbed everything so we might go up there i'm not sure are we so are we gonna go Nah, let's, yeah, we're going home. Are you sure? We are about to slide down the slide all the way down. That is so cool. Since we already walked the gray wall all the way up, now we're sliding down. So, are you ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. Woo! Yeah, let's go, let's go. Heading to Shanghai. Going to be taking the bullet train. <laughs> Fancy. Is 
so many stations. Unfortunately, when we arrived, we were told that our Airbnb got canceled. We booked another Airbnb, and then that cancels as well. So we're here at Shanghai Rail Station looking for an alternative. Hopefully, we can find something soon. Otherwise, we're sleeping here. So after about two hours waiting, trying to look for a spot, looks like we finally found one. A little hassle, a little stressful, but hey. At the end of the day, never, we never gave up, and that was the motivation of this whole trip, and looks like we're gonna be going to a new Airbnb. Welcome to Shanghai, baby. Shanghai in the house. Shanghai. Day two in Shanghai. It's a very nice day today. Let's see what the day brings us. We're at this little market. Where is it? Where is this? There you go. Yeah, look at this chicken. All those pigeons. Cage. The China life. Taking a shortcut through an alley. Oh, that's dope. This is definitely will be your house in China because you love cats. Because <laughs> there's paintings on the wall. Yeah. <laughs> 
This is so beautiful. What is going on? That's the second tallest building in the world. Did you guys know that ice cream was invented in China? How about that? I did not know. Did you know? I did not know. Oh well. But now I know. <laughs> Try some dumplings. We're waiting in line for some dumplings. Soupy dumplings. Soupy dumplings. <laughs> Time for dumplings. Where did you the bathroom. Dumplings. These are cute little dumplings. They're like pigs. You guys ready? Mm, yeah. Dumplings. Oh, okay. Yeah. One last look at Shanghai after going to Xi'an. Breakfast really heavy. Everything in here is breakfast. Look at that. Heavy food for breakfast. Nice neighborhood. Crazy, this is a nice city. Okay, family dinner. Look how crazy this vending machine is. What do they have in there? They have all this, right? All this vegetable. <laughs> what is this? Look how expensive grapes are. Yeah, grapes are really expensive. That's crazy. And you order here, and it comes out here. She and... This is so beautiful. <laughs> oh, it's like a 
down, count down to when we can watch. Traffic lights here. I'm gonna miss this Airbnb so much. It was so much nice. Has four rooms. The view is crazy. Good morning from Xi'an. The motto of the city of Xi'an. trip is over we're heading back home uh, i hope you guys enjoyed the video uh, stay tuned as more trips is on the way um, as for china we definitely have to say that it's an experience that everybody should do um, it's totally worth it and possibly a one in a lifetime experience for us um, and it was definitely definitely a good trip to remember and, and we just can't wait to see what other, what more trips we will take in the future. So all I can say is stay tuned and we'll see you soon. Gotta thank Chris for taking us everywhere. Yeah. If it wasn't for them, we would have been a little bit lost, but it was a good we had a good time yeah, so Thank you and if you go out, enjoy and have fun. Peace.